Hey, hello everyone. In this episode of The Amazing World, we will be discussing about something which is perky, spiky, scary, but time. Yes, we are talking about the thorny dragon. And here's a DIY hack to make your own thorny dragon. Get a prickly thorny stick and blow life into it. And ta-da! We have the thorny devil. Well, that obviously was not the origin of this tiny guy, but yes, it does look like it. This creepy looking creature belongs to the species of lizards endemic to Australia. Thanks to its looks, it has got many names. A few of them include the mountain devil, thorny lizard, thorny dragon, etc. Even though they look a bit scary with the spikes and all, their favorite meal are the ants. They live in a very hostile environment in the deserts. And in order to survive, they have to adapt accordingly. So this tiny spiky dude uses many tricks of adaptation for survival, such as camouflage, their teeth, spikes, water consumption mechanism, and their false hair. Their spiky brown and yellow colors help them blend in with the landscapes of the desert. And not just that, they can swallow drawing air, just like a puffer fish. This makes them look bigger than they are. Just in case any of the predators are fine with a crunchy spiky meal. Their teeth are specially modified to crunch on the hard sheet in the bodies of the ants. One of the shocking features of Thorny Devil is that it drinks water through its skin. In between the spikes are numerous tiny grooves which acts like a straw to collect water. Their skin literally works like a blotting paper, sucking in water from wherever possible. The ward of the predator, our tiny friend uses his last resort. But the first thing that you protect when someone comes to hit you. Yeah, your head. And that's what our thorny friend is. It has a dummy head full of spikes, of course. When confronted by a predator, it ducks its real head to avoid injuries. So which of the superpowers of the thorny devil would you like to have? Or which one really surprised you? Let us know in the comment section.